What's going on boys and girls, Aaron here, Empire Toys 1138 and on this video we're going to go hit up my local car boot sale. I'm there now, I'm going to go join the queue and hopefully we find some cool bits because I feel like I haven't been to a booty for ages with the weather and just being busy. So uh, looking forward to getting around, getting some steps in and hopefully finding some cool retro toys. So anyway guys, check out the video, like, subscribe, all that jazz and uh, I'll see you very soon at the end for a pickup haul. Fingers crossed. <laughs> How much you got these? How much are you guys look? Um, five each. Five each. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty. Do you want four for fifteen? Yeah? Amazing. so strong when you pick up a load of mask. <laughs> that is what you want to see. That is the booty. I really hope the camera called. <laughs> What you got to fix, mate? That's six pounds. Oh, okay. No worries, mate. Biggest thing in it. I'm trying to find out what is missing. Got an Optimus Prime there. A few figs in here that I haven't stolen since. Let's You're right, mate. How much you got on these bits and bobs? Making out about to go along. Okay. Right, what you got? That one? Eight quid. Okay. What about the little ones in all in there? Uh, all the piggins and stuff. Yeah. A uh, pound a piece. Okay. And everything in there is free for a pound, yeah? Oh, no, that's toy cars. I need to get me cars. Toy cars, okay. All right, cool. Only that one in there, yeah. This is this one. That's what I was thinking of. 
Oh, all right. I that's what. A stick in the middle of it. Yeah, and that's then what it confuses it. So you know what? I might not put that. I'll just call that a fiver. <laughs> Joe's just after clearing the toy cars, but. Confusion. That's right. Oh, is that what's in that? I thought it was just a jelly ball. I didn't even know. No, I didn't even know what it is. Are these things? Oh, I'd assume so. There's about Wouldn't know, but. There's half a dozen of them here. Probably it looks like it, doesn't it? I do follow. Yeah, thank you. Chew the gun. Watch this. What's it going to rain for? Barricade. Oh, there's lots of. Probably going to look back at this video after and be like, oh, I should have picked that up. I don't know what's on the console. Are these the G1s I picked up the other G2s or whatever? Or are these new ones? 92. I literally picked these up from the boot for not so long ago. I'll grab them. Right guys, we are done. Been around, found some few bits, got off to a good start, midway through, didn't really uh, find much, and then found a few bits at the end, and just uh, had a laugh at some of the uh, mental prices. But we're gonna head home now, and uh, go through a few bits now, because it's getting really busy here, and I am hungry, get a bacon sandwich on the go, 100%. Anyway guys, take it easy, and I will go through my bits when I get home. So I thought I'd do a quick video like this, just to show what I found at the boot sale. So you saw on the video, first thing I picked up, was this nice mask pickup. Now, there's a few bits missing, like the, the uh, wheels on this, missing their rubber. Um, this one's got it. I can't remember their names all the top of my head. Um, this one, again, it's got missing one there, but it's still, and again, they're missing a few extra accessories, but to find mask at the boot fair, especially the vehicles, um, up until this year, I've never really found any vehicle mask stuff, and from the same boot fair, I've now found uh, on two different occasions, mass vehicles. So that's pretty cool. Uh, it was great to see. You saw it in the video. <laughs> Literally double sprinted when I saw it on the floor. Uh, got it for a good price. A couple of figures that were included. Ooh. Focus. It's there. And pretty much up until um, I picked up this on camera, that was it. It was a real blowout, which was a shame. Um, this, I believe, is a Toys R Us exclusive, if I remember rightly. But as you saw, the guy just had loads of stuff, loads of bits and bobs just everywhere. And I probably left bits behind because there was just so much all spread out. And there was a cool Transformer anyway. A couple of uh, Clone Wars, Star Wars figures because they're always good. Oh, that's caught on. <laughs> um, I've got accessories and everything for these, so they're an easy pickup because I can just match them up. got the TIE Fighter Pilot here. There was a, a lightsaber in the uh, mismatch of things, so I made sure I picked that up as well. Um, and from that guy as well, I picked up these the, the mini cons. The head, oh, I can't remember. I picked them up ages ago at the boot fair as well. So to see them again was pretty funny. So these are Gen 2, 92 um, const uh, constructor cons or whatever they're. They're not headmasters, I don't think. But anyway. Again, cool pickup. There's a few more bits you saw there in the video, but I just couldn't go through them all, and loads of people kept coming up and going through them as well. Off camera, I picked up the Site B Lost World Ian Malcolm as well. Um, that was again, I was pretty much walking out. The lady had a couple of Ken of Batmans on there, but I wasn't too bothered. But a cool Ian Malcolm, can't go wrong with that. So, yeah, that was uh, the finds from the boot fair. Again, straight away finding this on like the second row, I thought we could be in for one of those great days but uh unfortunately it didn't but the actual um i can keep that steady the actual find it's not too bad um it's raining at the moment and i think it's raining tomorrow so there'll be no boot fares or anything like that so i'm just gonna chill out tomorrow and uh enjoy the day off but if you do go out hunting have good stuff and uh make sure you follow toy division on facebook go join the group uh like all my social medias instagram facebook twitter and uh if you haven't already please like and subscribe to the channel anyway guys take it easy happy hunting and peace